say we have a satellite which appears to move which let's say moves in the equatorial plane of the earth's equator so let's say a satellite moving around earth in equatorial plane is observed by the person standing at the equator he observes its period as 16 hours we need to find the actual time period this is our problem firstly when we say a man is standing at the equator and looking at a satellite in the equatorial plane say something like this the satellite could possibly be going in this direction or in this direction in either of the cases, what really is going to matter to us is the relative omega of the satellite with respect to the planet. That is the basic determining factor of this problem. If we are able to figure out that in terms of the given quantity, we can thus say what is the actual time period of the satellite as well as we can also point out which one is in which sense of rotation. So let's do that. Let's say the observed omega of satellite is omega S E. So observed omega is basically the relative omega. So relative omega can be written as omega s plus minus omega e. This is actual omega of the satellite. This is the actual omega of earth. This is what we have. This has come from the basic concepts of relative velocity what we have studied long time back. So this is our equation. Omega SE can be written as 2 pi by 16. I'm ignoring the multiplier of seconds, but this will give me a result in per hour. Omega Earth, as we know, is 2 pi by 24, which is 24 hours, basically it's time period. This comes from the fact that Omega is equal to 2 pi by T. Putting this in our equation, we get 2 pi by 16 equals 2 pi by X, say X is the actual time period of the satellite plus minus 2 pi by 24. Solving for the plus sign first, we get 2 pi by x equals 2 pi by 16 minus 2 pi by 24. This gives me x equals 48.
सॉल्विंग फॉर द माइनस साइन वी हैव टू पाई बाई एक्स इक्वल्स टू पाई बाई सिक्सटीन आई एम सॉरी दिस यस टू पाई बाई एक्स विल बी इक्वल टू टू पाई बाई सिक्सटीन प्लस टू पाई बाई ट्वेंटी फोर विच गिवस एक्स इक्वल्स नाइन पॉइंट सिक्स ऑल आर इन आर्स this and this both are possible time periods of the satellite we are getting two values because we have considered both both the cases the satellite can be moving along with the earth in the sense of rotation of earth or it can be moving in the opposite sense of rotation of the earth if the satellite were moving in the opposite sense this is the time period we discover and if it were rotating in the same sense this is the time period we find so what we have forty eight hours this is greater than sixteen hours therefore observed is less than actual when sense of rotation is opposite nine point six hours is less than 16 hours this says observed is greater than actual and hence the sense of rotation is the same 